Hey guys, I'm excited to talk to you today about a new series that I wanna do for the next month or so, and I wanna cover a couple of Hack5 tools that I've bought. Um, I've played with some of them uh, more recently, I've had some for a few years, and uh, Hack5 just makes a lot of really, really great products. So I've been a big fan of their stuff for a while. They released some stuff later last year, and I just picked them up and it arrived, and I'm looking forward to doing a uh, YouTube series on these items. So let's quickly go through them, and uh, I'll include the links below in the description of this video to whichever product uh, you wanna actually see and jump right to that video if you're interested. Um, so the first one is, I'll show you the rubber duck. Uh, this, is a, this is one we've used many, many times and uh, basically it looks like a thumb drive. Uh, I can quickly show you it here. Um, so to the average user, it looks like a thumb drive, but it actually acts like a keyboard. So you plug that into your computer and it can inject payload, uh, whatever payloads you pre-programmed onto this. So this is a lot of fun. Um, and it's also really good for sysadmins or any repetitive tasks that you have to do. So that's the rubber duck. Um, this one's a new one, it's called the uh, Plunderbug. It's a network sniffer, so it's um, basically a man in the middle, so you plug an ethernet cable into here, plug the other one going into here, going to the switch or whatever it might be, and you can basically grab all the packets that are going across that wire uh, in either real time or just download them later to be reviewed. So that's a, that's a packet sniffer, so we'll review that one as well. This one I'm kind of the most interested in. I don't have all the information on it. It's called the Owl. Um, and it's basically uh, like a USB device that just plugs into the computer. It has a USB pass-through, so you can kind of discreetly like hook it up to a computer and, and not take up an, an active port. You can plug it into the computer and then whatever was plugged into that port, you can plug into here. And then you can have like other Wi-Fi adapters or Bluetooth adapters here, but this can call home and you can do uh, like wireless sniffing or you can do some payload injections and some other kind of cool stuff like that. So I've only just read up a little bit on the Owl and so far I think it's a, it's a pretty cool product. It's one that I'm most interested in getting my hands on. Um, this one's called a screen grab. Crab, I should say, and uh, this one's also, it's kind of cool. I'm, I'm kind of interested in the performance of it, and it's an HDMI man in the middle, so you have the HDMI um, maybe going to the computer in a boardroom or something like that here, and then you have the output of this going to your TV, and then all the HDMI traffic that's going through is captured. It could either go to a uh, SD card or it can plug into a Wi-Fi and upload the images. I, I think you can do different kinds of timing, like uh, once a minute or once every 30 seconds or possibly even in some real time. I'm, I'm curious to try this out. I'm wondering, like, could you use it for gaming? Can you get enough frames per second to, uh, to capture gaming videos and stuff? Um, anyways, that's a pretty cool device called the Screen Crab. And what else we got here? We have the Pineapple. This one I've used many times before for different kind of Wi-Fi searches. Uh, you can also do... Um, any kind of number of Wi-Fi attacks on this. So you can try to decrypt Wi-Fi passwords. You can try to see if there's any rogue access points around. You can do uh, DDoS, kick people off the network, things like that. Uh, so that's the Pineapple. That's a pretty cool device. And I'll show you how we use that in the field for different kinds of security testing. Um, this one's probably my uh, second favorite one that I'm, I'm interested in trying, the, one of the new ones that they've done. Um, uh, besides the owl, it's called the Shark Jack. And essentially what this does is if you pop this little cap off, that's an RJ45, an Ethernet, and that you can just plug into any rogue uh, network port. Um, so it could be in a boardroom or at a reception desk or something like that, you just plug that in, and then there's different arming modes uh, with this switch. And so it can automatically quickly do an Nmap uh, scan of whatever it gets on the network. It can do other kinds of um, networking scans and report back to you what's going on. Uh, so I haven't played too much with this guy yet, uh, but I'm excited to, to do this video as well. So that's the Shark Jack. So these are cool little devices that sysadmins or pen testers or um, or bad actors could use. Um, we're gonna only talk about how to use these things for good or at the worst, some pranks on your friends. But um, these are really, really cool devices. I'm not sponsored by Hack5 by any means. Um, I've just been a big fan of their, their products and uh, I did a bunch of purchasing late last year and I can't wait to share them with you guys. So uh, stay tuned, hit that subscribe button if you wanna see as these be released. I'll put the links in the description below when all the videos are in fact released. And um, yeah, I'm looking forward to just going through all the products and showing you guys what they're capable of. Thanks, see you.